to my channel on my days feels weird so guys i'm basically in london what's this lighting looking like yeah okay yeah so i'm basically in london arrived yesterday evening around 10 p.m i came with my little sister we're here for the weekend so we came here on friday leaving on tuesday and just here for the vibes really it's carnival weekend bank holiday on the monday so i thought do you know what i mean like it's gonna be a nice get away for a bit i don't know whether i should just do like my standard videos and get some videos done for youtube or whether i should vlog because every time i try to vlog in london it just doesn't go right i think i can only vlog like in the comfort of my own home or if i'm on holiday because i feel like shy and stuff like I don't know if I'm going to be able to do it, but I'll try. And actually, I should really stick this one out because every time I give it a try, I just give up. Um, but yeah, this is our Airbnb where we're staying and I think it's just so cute. I'm going to show you around. So this is the front door. This is, No, this is the back door where you can obviously get into it. And then you come in. This is where we came through in last time. And you see this. We've made a mess already this is what you see so got the lovely sitting area on this side the lady is so sweet like she left me a card she said hey girl imagine hey girl and she left me like this cute note thank you for your stay and like just a really nice message bottle of wine some toffee popcorn some olives don't like olives but thank you um, so yeah, that's so like sweet of her, like really nice, really nice um, service. But yeah, this is a sitting area. This lamp, I'm going to show you in the evening. It is so gorgeous when this is on, like it's such a vibe. Then we've got this cute mirror over here. Like this is, you know, it's giving, do you know what I mean? It's just so, why would I do that? Um, then we obviously have the kitchen. Also messed it up a little bit, but we got Chinese yesterday. The little last fridge got our food in there. Got a microwave. We didn't even eat our food. I'm gonna have to heat up today. This is the kitchen. It's actually I think my favourite place in the in this apartment. So cute. Huge ass TV, which is smart. We've got my things here. This door is locked. Um shoe rack, hoover there. That's the front door that you can also go into, um, come into, so come in from, apologies. And then this is the bathroom, which is, you know, also a little cute vibe. But to be honest, okay, and this is the, the room. It's already a mess. Let's try to keep the mess to a minimum, yeah? Say hello and hi. hi We're about to head out because I need to go to Primark because I've started my period imagine my period lately hasn't even been coming this early usually more time it's coming on like the first 31st of the month so what's going on i think it knew i was about to have fun today and it's like up uh, up uh, up uh, hold up <sighs> anyways started my period so i need to go to primark and get myself like some proper panties because I didn't think, like, I was starting to get, like, a bit of cramps, but I didn't actually think it was going to come on today. And I only got cramps for, like, a day. Usually I get cramps for, like, two, three days before my period comes. And today I decided to literally just advance things. I don't know what's going on. Oh, But, yeah, I need to go Primark, get myself some proper um, knickers, period knickers, because I didn't bring any. And um, some shorts as well that I can wear inside my skirt. Because... I'm wearing a skirt today and I'm on my period so I'm not I'm not I'm not gonna do that so I need to make sure that I have shorts underneath my skirt otherwise I'm just not gonna go I'm not gonna feel comfortable we should have actually have left by 11 o'clock but it's currently where's my phone Jeanette, why are you putting on makeup Mascara. where's my phone 
Oh, it's in the bag. It's currently Saturday, 11.14. Need to hurry up because I'm trying to get ready for four o'clock or even half three. Um, and I want to do like my YouTube videos and like do a get ready with me and like do, you know, my little outfits. Like I just want to make sure that, you know, I have enough time to do what I need to do. So we need to be out of here like yesterday, Janalia. Guys, you know, I got really shook yesterday. My camera started doing... Like, I need to take the camera to go get fixed because it's doing something and it's scaring me. Like, it's saying lens error, like there's something wrong with my lens. And it's like, don't do that. It wasn't working for ages and I had to try, like, bang it. And it's eventually letting me use it. But every time I switch it off, it still says lens error. And I'm just not trying to deal with that. Like, I don't want any issues. I'm getting back on YouTube, like, and I don't want any problems. I just want things to go smoothly. Oh, why is it breaking? Like, don't do this. Like, the, the time I decide to, like, jump my phone and start doing videos. Why is, my act, why is my camera acting up? Like, don't do that to me. Maybe I should do my edges before I leave the house. Very ghetto. Right. Put on this jacket. It's so blipping huge. But I put on this jacket and I'm gonna wear this bag with it. And this is the Erin vibes that I'm going for. And I also did my edges so I don't look homeless. DLC. So, forgot to, not forgot, like I tried buying a tripod, yeah. Try buying one tripod came, wasn't suitable, but another one came, wasn't suitable. So now I'm left without a bloody tripod. But all I need is some lips and we gotta leave. We actually have to leave like right now. I don't know what the heck Janela's doing, but we got to leave. We need like the comfortable ones. The boxes are good though. Are you medium? Yeah. No, small. I want the smallest one. These have to be tight. Is that extra small? Okay, so I have to get this. And then I don't know if this is, no. If I'm already getting this material, I don't want this one. These I are want, pretty though. Yeah, but I want the, the more like... Do you know which ones I'm trying to look for? No. Like this. Yeah. Hmm? Yeah. Why are they all open? Yeah. That's polka dots, Shana. Why would I want polka dots? I feel so awkward trying to record in public. <laughs> Imagine, like, holding up the camera like... Hi, guys. In public. I don't know how they do it. <laughs> That's so crazy. It has you with you as well. Yeah. I guess when you get paid for it, you have more confidence, in it? Yeah. But you did it. When? You did it. Did it when? I don't on holiday. Yeah. Yeah. But like in public, like this. Yeah, you've done in, it. In, on travel. Do I do that casually every day? <laughs> Absolutely not. Right, guys. We finished the task for the day which was to go to Primark and get myself some panties for my period. Because I need to be comfortable if I'm going out. So yeah, now we're headed back to the Airbnb. All right guys, so we've made it to the bus station. My head shake looks weird. Does it? You know whose head shake you have? Mom's. No. Nice. Two bedrooms. Yeah, that's yeah, the yeah, they do. And growing up, I think you had to look like him, but anyways. I can't wait. You know, I haven't beat my face in ages. I'm excited to do that. <laughs> I'm so excited. But I didn't get any um, new makeup products, so I'm just gonna have to. Oh, you know, I've been dropping my phone so much lately. 
so we're off the bus now and I'm trusting Janalia with the maps again but if she gets me lost one more time she ain't going out because that just shows how much confidence I have on her in, in walking around you made us get lost last time I didn't really know. yeah you did for a split second oh this is not the cemetery this is a different part I thought you knew no guys we had to walk around the cemetery um, whilst we were making our way there which we thought was a bit weird I thought like cemeteries were like private land and like do you know what I mean I didn't think people walked around like <laughs> just walked around and visited like the the dead's home on their way weird the weather is so gorgeous there are we not here already yeah we just need to get to the right block it looks like the right thingy flats these yeah. flats are actually nice you know don't they look all right i think it's obviously a bit outdated but it looks all right it is outdated yeah Home sweet home. I think I'm gonna eat. <sighs> Heating up some food because I'm actually hungry. So we got food, um, what do you call it? What we got in yesterday. But then somehow we just didn't eat. Well, me. So now how do I'll eat? Why didn't I eat yesterday? I think I was just like, I don't know, maybe tired. But we hadn't eaten the whole day. think we'd come back at 12 30. i mean we didn't take long yeah we literally went in and out this lighting is cute it's a cute lighting okay the braids look all right you know i haven't been feeling these braids huh i haven't been feeling these braids what? i don't know i think it's the color i don't know if it suits me i think it's i should have just gone with black i should have just gone with black why Cause I feel like more myself, like more natural. It's different, I guess. Look, my auntie did them for me. I don't know, I feel like this part is too white. It's the exact like style and braid that I want. I think I just got it wrong with the color. Like this is not the color that I wanted. Yeah, I wanted more of a mixture. Like here it's too golden. I wanted more of a a mixture of colors but i couldn't find a 10 the pack that i needed the packs that i needed was a 24 a 10 and a 613 and i kept finding the 613s and the 27s i think it's 27 not 24 but never the 10s so i just had to make do with like two of the colors i didn't know what else to do so wow good timing this is what i got from from the takeout yesterday Jenna said she really enjoyed the Charmaine. Not really enjoyed it. You said it was nice. It was alright. I like the wings. The wings are nice. I should have washed my hands. Have we washed our hands? No, but I wash the dishes so like <laughs> so <laughs> You'd want your mum your mom to have a, a bum. A decent one. Boys look weird with bums anyway. Do you know what I mean? Their bums are so weird. They're so cute though, that's why it's so weird. <laughs> it's like, why, so round. <laughs> why do your bum look like that? Gone this is where he came from. He was in some house. Let's see me, bro. Sure. He's like a dream man. And not just and physical attraction. His personality is a one. Him getting his well, from what we see on TV. Friend. 
guys i'm gonna come back when i'm getting ready bye this is you in my my youtube setup stuff um this is my full length and my sister's currently showering in the shower she needs hurry this is like my my setup my skincare sanitary why am i showing this on anyways it's normal it's normal to show a bit of tampons and pads in the camera um a woman okay so there we go that's that <laughs> so yeah now i feel ready to yes i was telling you to hurry up but now i feel ready be right back y'all i'll probably come back on when i have finished getting ready because i'm gonna film a video separate video catch her on the flip side okay so i'm at the station on my way to um, the event and i'm gonna be late i don't know if i'm gonna be allowed in so it's like basically five o'clock and it takes an hour to get there now i'm 10 now i'm 15 to reach the location meaning i'm gonna be 15 minutes late and last entry 6 pm so wish me luck now i feel so uncomfortable i'm wearing a mini skirt yeah and it keeps rising up like i don't want to keep like lowering my i don't want to keep lowering my skirt to dance for you like i want to feel comfortable not too happy about that i wish i could have put on a coat but i didn't have like an appropriate coat to be a bum too many things gone wrong let's see let's see what this is gonna bring but i'm just gonna keep wearing my shades and just wear the ground guys i shouldn't even be smiling i should not be smiling because imagine imagine only this only this shit happens to me like guys so i've changed this is a new fit so i'm wearing the two piece from women's wear this denim jacket my zebra print bag from pretty little thing and my docs this is how I'm going. Imagine my skirt ripping. Imagine. That's just so ghetto. No, that's so pretty. So, Joyce. Hi, guys. I'm going to be vlogging for you. <laughs> Not us getting lost. They're like, oh, sorry. We're getting lost in like. Let's get to the location. It is 9.39 and I don't want to talk, I just want to dance. Period. <laughs> We just want to get in the dancery. We just want to shake a bit in the ash. Vibe a little. It's been a long day, but we're gonna get there. This is, yeah. We're currently on the way to the event. We're literally like, what, less than 10 minutes away? Mm, two minutes away. Yeah, but it's like nearly 10. So hopefully this let us in. The event goes on till 4 a.m. anyway, so surely, we're allowed in at 10 a.m. 10 p.m. Should have made that one. You know what I mean? Good afternoon vlog. I can't even remember the last thing I showed you guys, but I had a rough day. I had a rough night. The amount of what's it called? The amount of um unfortunate events that occurred yesterday all in one gal it was a lot to endure it was a lot to take so let me walk you through the day 
so got ready everything was great feeling myself yeah. outfits looking cute obviously you lot you lot would have seen the footage like when i put on the skirt there was a rip on it why is there a rip on the skirt but I know that I cool, I can still make it work, do you know what I mean? Because I, I wasn't, I was feeling the outfit, I wasn't really trying to change it to anything else. Then I leave the house now. I'm on my way to make my journey to meet my friend at Wembley Park. Skirt is rising up. I feel uncomfortable. I'm like, you know, there's people looking at me on the streets. There's men obviously doing their cat calling. And I feel uncomfortable. Skirt's rising, I'm thinking, nah, like, what am I going to do? Am I going to go back? Because I was already late at this point. I was like, nah, like, I can't go back. Like, I'm already late. Last entry, six, like, I might not even get in type of bad. So I was like, let me go. On my way to the event now. I'm obviously running so late. Um, but then I meet a few people across. Along the way, sorry, I'm at this girl that was, all, that was also going from my uni. And we were just chatting. And then we got off the station finally at our destination. And then I was, I went to meet my Miller, my Miller, I went to meet my friend Miller at the station. So as soon as I met up with Miller, I went into one corner to like straighten up my skirt before we leave the station to obviously break the way to the event. Tell me why, when I go into the corner to try and fix my skirt, tell me why the skirt ripped. Like, I'm not talking about a little rip. I'm talking the skirt ripped. Like, you know, the zip part ripped. It's gone. So I'm thinking, shit, what am I going to do? Like, I'm literally five minutes away from the event, from the venue, and my skirt rips. Bro, I was so, like, in shock. I couldn't even believe what was happening. Miller was like, we have to go home. Like, this is the other option. We have to go home. We need to go home. I'm thinking, shit, man. Like, what have I done? I think we even tried looking for, like, some shopping centers nearby to see if I could find something. But I think there was no where I could go shop close by. And we were already late. Like, this was already, like, at half six, probably seven o'clock. No, this was like at half six, so we're like, we're already late. We don't even know if we're gonna get in. By the time we go, you know, find something else to wear and come back, like, will we even be let in? And if I go home and change, come back, so an hour journey, like, hour there, hour back, like, they're probably not even gonna let us in. It's mad. So we obviously decided to go home, come home now to the Airbnb to change, but then manage an hour journey putting in the keys to unlock my airbnb now it's not opening right it's not opening i'm thinking what's going on my sister's taking the back door key so i only had the front door key front door's not opening i said fucking hell like this is not what i need to know i'm locked outside it's cold like my skirt's ripped like what the fuck is going on so for the language but what is going on like what is actually going on like this is oh uh, like oh uh, oh uh, and then i had to call my airbnb host i was like hello i'm so sorry but i'm locked out i don't have the front door the back door gear has got the front door but it's not opening and then she had to get one of her I don't know, friend assistance, whatever, to come bring me the key. Who then unlocked the door for me, and then we realised that I'd locked something from the inside, which is why I can unlock it from the outside. <sighs> and then it was a hassle to find a new outfit, found something to pop on, and then we made our way to this other event because we'd booked two events, and obviously we weren't going to make recess anymore. But apparently, people were still getting into recess. I don't know. But, yeah, me and my friend made our way to this other event that we had tickets to, which was, like, an hour journey as well. Went there, paid late fee, got into the event, cool. So, you know, the step in, it's like a bar type of event. And they were like, oh, the main, the main room is opening in, like, 30 minutes. That event, recess was 25 plus, I'm pretty sure that event was a 30 plus because the amount of ghetto I was seeing up in the dance stream, just ghetto, encore and auntie vibes, I said no, like, and the type of me, they were playing like old school Afrobeats, you know who those old school Afrobeats are for, like, although we do enjoy it, but like, that's for the boomers, 
like please like give us some like i will wait for you those type of vibes give me some Rima, give me some um Kulosa, give me some some mainstream music right now no they're playing i think i don't top your mother they're playing i don't do like the fuck i'm not gonna listen to that right now i want to be up in recess in the fucking vibe in the box park enjoying and living my best life and listening to drake listen to i wanted i want to be where the 25 pluses are i don't want to be where the 30 pluses are i was so livid i was like what the fuck is this bought a few drinks i was just like in my own corner like just like like sipping on my drink and just watching like just people watching it was just the go and then eventually their main room opened went into the main room now and it's freezing and they're obviously playing good tunes now they're playing bashman which is something i love to hear bashman and you know dance hall those type of vibes and that was lit we i guess vibed a little bit to that but the atmosphere the people like it just wasn't the vibes that we were after that's just not the vibes that we wanted and it was just so sad like and when it got to like midnight and i was like nah i need to go home miller was with one of her other friends so i just said i'm gonna go home she stayed because she still wanted to stay until a certain point because she had to meet someone so i was like you stay i'll go made my way back now got on the journey i had to get a taxi to the station because it was like um i think like an 18 minute walk to the station i was like nah i'm gonna get a cab got a cab 10 pounds got to the station now it's closed station like half as i'm getting there they're literally closing like fencing it off i said what is going on here like this is so rude come out the the station now bearing in mind it's cold i'm by myself i just want to get home i'm willing to do anything to get home i'm looking for ubers now to perhaps take me to the next closest station couldn't find anything couldn't find any other routes that like had a station nearby all the stations all the undergrounds were closing i'm assuming that I'm, like most of the stations on the underground were shut so i try looking for a cab now to come home couldn't get a cab like no one was accepting my ride and it was so rude and when they accepted it they'd cancel it it was like rah like what i even tried bowl i tried uber like it was just it was looking peak it was really looking peak so i couldn't get a taxi i couldn't get a, a uber ride home bear in mind they're costing me like 50 pounds i was like i do not care like i just want to get home i'll pay the 50 quid get me home because i'm over it. i'm over the whole day like get me home couldn't get a taxi and then i went back on my google maps to try and see like what route can i take to get home but no and this is in someone said it's east i was in old street and i'm coming to west croydon size thornton heath ah <sighs> found a bus joining i had to get a bus still on that for like 10 minutes and then get another bus and I stayed on that journey for like an hour, over an hour, which was a long, like it was the longest thing ever. But just before my second boss journey, I got McDonald's, which is great. Got me a chicken burger with some fries. The fries were the best thing that I had touched that night, like that I'd ever seen that, that day. Like it was just so amazing to have some nice fries, you know, after a long flipping day so i had that on the bus journey i was yamming i'm sure people are looking at me like i shouldn't ever like she ever eaten before because the way i was eating food like i've actually never eaten it before um so i had my mcdonald's and then i slept and then got out of the bus and then i had to walk 10 minutes 10 15 minutes to my location try getting taxis there was no taxis so i said i'm just gonna have to walk it. i just want to get home so i'm running it and you know these streets were cold and dark like at like two o'clock in the morning nearly three o'clock in the morning actually there were foxes and shit i said no nah, get me home speeding it to get home finally get in and i just conked out and i'm here took off my makeup actually like that was actually really brave of me i'm happy that i did that um and here i am and now my friends are trying to convince me to go carnival which i'm not doing like after that whole experience like that was a long day and i'm not willing to have another long day carnival's a long ass day like crowds getting around like that's just long i'm not trying to do that 
and no nah, i'm just not trying to do that like it's not that deep like i'm sure it'll be a good time but i'm not on it like i'm really not on it like i'm just so over it and now we had plans to go take pictures and the place that i wanted to go take pictures in is closed most of the galleries are closed Juno's just gonna go out to see cousins and i might go out with tamira i don't know but that's where we're at it would be nice to see tamira because if i don't see her today then i won't see her tomorrow Song we heard imagine we were making our way making our way to the, the event after we changed and everything we we obviously went past box park croydon twice and that's where dlt was and we had the vibes we we're like no nah! we wanted to cry so bad we we're like get us somewhere get us in there we want to enjoy oh it was so heartbreaking and this is a song that we had it was so sad that's literally the song of the the summer the song of our end of summer because that was depressing listening to that and like knowing that we have nowhere to go we're not going to vibes oh my gosh it was destroying if that's a word i was distraught bro my outfit banged like i'm actually gonna write a sturdy review because apparently Tamira's friend, my friend's friend, apparently had the same issue. Apparently, she bought a skirt, the same skirt she bought from them, and her dress ripped as well. But thank God she had a sewing machine, and it happened before she went out. Mine happened on the set. That is crazy. You can't be ruining people's days like that. Why are your skirts not? Why is the quality not there? that's what we should be now we need to do better clothing brands i'm sorry if you're going to watch this i'm sorry if you ever come across my videos but now nah, that woman's wear skirt i would not recommend to a friend because clearly it wasn't just me like the skirt is obviously very tight fit and the construction is not sturdy so do better girls i got a size 8 to 10 and i know that's my size i know it and if it, if it was a tight fit and people have to size up, then let us know. Do you know what I mean? Let us know. You didn't let us know. And now my skirt ripped. And I couldn't go to the function. I couldn't enjoy my bank holiday weekend. Great stuff. Anyways, chat. I'm going to stop talking about this day. I'm going to stop complaining. I'm going to stop reminiscing on the tragedy that it was yesterday. I'm just going to try and move forward with my life. And, you know, just keep going. Because that's all I can do. Right, guys. So, I am ready to go out. I'm going to call Janalia so we can do our outfits of the day. So, this is me. I'm wearing this white shirt from Nike. I got it on ASOS. It's quite baggy, purposely. Um, I got this in an extra, extra large, I think. Um, wearing this bag from Zara, like the retro kind of vibe. Um, jewelry is always ASOS, Vivian Westwood, ASOS, ASOS. Um, and I'm wearing a two piece, I'm wearing the two piece from Women's Wear. So it's a short and bralette kind of a two piece. And I'm wearing some trends. That's me. We're about to head out. Might go take some pictures and I'm going to meet up with Tamira after so that we can have something to eat but that's the vibe do you want to talk us through your fit <laughs> i got um the hoodie from pretty little thing cargoes from pretty little thing yeah. and got the wrong bag but we <laughs> yeah <laughs> cute <laughs> I already showed y'all my outfit and I think I look cool, okay? You do look cool. So we're currently on our way to um, take some content, like just take pictures. And then Janalia, is this the bus stop? 4.50. So it's coming at 29. Is that the bus we're taking? To where? To... All right, we're gonna go try and take some cute pictures. And then Janalia's gonna go to see our cousin. And then I'm gonna meet up with Tamira to go for food somewhere. And then I'm gonna go get Janali and then we're gonna come home. So it's gonna be a cute little trip. I just thought of 
have a brand new YouTube video idea. I'm gonna start showing locations, like where to take nice picture locations on YouTube, because I think it's so hard to find. And I think we actually need it as content creators. I think some people are so stingy with that location. Like, look at this beautiful place. I can imagine taking some sick pictures over Yay. here. Don't you want it? No, I don't think it'll look nice with your fit. Me? Yeah. No, this is too bougie. Yeah. Not too bougie, but even the colours, like... It doesn't look nice. It's a little colours. But yeah, we're on our way to our first location. Um, and I might come back here to shoot one other outfit that I have in mind, but I'll post a second part if I do come to do it. No, this is such a cute spot. I've got such a cute outfit for this, but I need the bag, and I don't have the bag, so I don't know what to do. But I really want picture in this area. This is so pretty. Anyways. Just <sighs> trying to fit the bill. Just chill. <laughs> Always singing. Thank God I came out today. Because I was feeling so crap after yesterday. <sighs> Telling us to turn the other way then. Shall we go here? <laughs> Ooh, this yeah. is actually nice. <laughs> <laughs> See, I chose a nice location. Wow. Should I start here? <laughs> this is so gorgeous. And it's quite like quiet, <laughs> very quiet. <laughs> Maybe it's the time. Say hi, friends! <laughs> She's always so mean to the camera. Hello, hello, hello. hello. Look at this gorgeous girl. Hello, Leeds viewers. Woo. Welcome to London. <laughs> Welcome to London. Who yeah. told her it's just Leeds viewers? <laughs> <laughs> Who actually told her, please? Welcome to London. Don't you know I'm international? <laughs> International babe. But yeah, me and Tamira are on our way to our location. Our lo kitchen. <laughs> our location. To go eat in Tramp Kitchen. Woohoo! Some cocktails too, so we'll enjoy that. Wait, do we know where we're going? Do we know where we're walking to? Sometimes I look at myself, I just look old. You know, I've got like really deep smile like. You know, I've got really deep smile. Reminds me of my grandma, I'm like, why does your face look so heavy? Why are you Not an Amazon Fresh, I've actually never seen that before. Oh, it's there! Oh, I thought it'd be on the other side. That looks alright. Yeah. Looks kind of quiet though, isn't it? It looks close. <laughs> so we're at the restaurant, that kitchen. I haven't even started looking at the menu and stuff, but most of the toilet are like some way for her, but I'm going to look at the menu now. So I'm deciding what I'm going to get. I think I'm going to get the combo box, which comes with two sides of your choice. So I'm going to slab for £30 with the lobster tail. And then I'm going to go with the mac and cheese and chicken thighs. A drink! I got a shit glass. Yeah, look, mine's pretty crappy as well though. Don't you think? <laughs> I was, I was thinking I was going to get something yeah, like... Okay, big yeah. It looks alright, I guess. Yours is better. <laughs> it's sweet, but it's not as sweet as this one. It's 
Yeah, yeah. No, but yours has like a strong taste to it. What is it? Human thing. You don't want it? No, I'll be alright. Yeah, I'll be alright. I would rate the food a... <laughs> I don't know! Let so me think about it. You know what? I'm gonna go 8 out of 10. That's really good. Yeah, yeah. I'm gonna bring it 8 out of 10 because I did like the... Yeah, I think I do like the, the lobster was nice. And try and get his attention please. Um, I really like the lobster, I really like the prawns, I really like the prawn on the pole. Um, I think the wings, maybe I got the wrong flavour. Yeah, I yeah, of everything, yeah. And the flavour's like, was juicy. <laughs> it was like, nice juicy flavour. And we like the cocktail. So what makes it not a 9 or a 10? Um, I don't know. I mean, I to be honest, I'm thinking my experience with cats, I feel like we're not like in the most comfortable table Yeah, comfortable table, I'm not, I don't feel like comfortable, you know what I mean? I feel like that could have, yeah, that could have added to the experience, like a nicer, there's booths over there, but I can't show you because the team is sat there, but like, just somewhere more comfortable. That would have been nice. Yeah. If you went out, yeah. <laughs> I went you were talking. You were talking. <laughs> if you went camping, come to Trap Kitchen. Come to Trap Kitchen. We went into Amazon Fresh. <laughs> Bougie. Hi. Oh, we have to scan. I think you need a membership. Yeah. That's all you need. Either open up the app or go in the web browser. I've got the app. Yeah, the app's the easiest way. Okay. Okay, go to your basket when it opens. My basket. Yeah, the yeah. bottom. Then give it a second. Fresh code at the end there under the search bar. Then choose what card you'd like to use and that should be the final step. Then basically you take what you want and then leave and the store knows what you have due to like all the cameras. Oh. And then if every shelf has like a digital scale underneath it, knows the weight of each item. So if you pick something up, it knows that you've taken it because the weight's changed. But how does it know we've taken because it? Because when you scan in, the camera's going to turn you into a silhouette and gives you a what number. You and it's following that number around. So when you're near the shelf and the weight changes, it's kind of like allocated. Are you guys everywhere. listening to this? <laughs> <laughs> what the heck? That is so crazy. Yeah, it's a bit There's water here. Yeah. I can just go with a little Evian. Oh, there's an old picking this up. Oh, and then you just walk out. Yeah, that's crazy. That should be it, right? And then we just leave. Thank you. Yeah, it was a pound. Right, where's the station? I'm sure it's supposed to be. Where? Oh, underground. There it is. No, you know what? London is so be beautiful at night. Like, it's literally I such... I like that. Central. Yeah, central. Central vibes is a vibe. Yeah. <laughs> so pretty. I don't know if I could live in this, like, 24-7, though. It seems, like, just really, like, fast-paced all the time. Do you know what I mean? No, I think it'd be all right, but I just... I don't know. I, I, I kind of like my quiet time. Like, I like walks and like parks and like you yeah. know like sub is it suburb what's suburbs. the suburbs yeah i like quiet spaces as well do you know what i mean so i think i'd struggle a little bit it's a mixture for me. maybe just popping in and out would be all right like living like in essex and like popping I can do, in I can do essex. That's like the yeah like, yeah so we're gonna say goodbye now. Oh no! No, 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 no. Gonna miss tomorrow. you chicken. Stop it. Gonna miss you chicken tomorrow. No, stop it.
Seriously. You know, so, so, so even if I decide to go, I don't think we'll even bump into each other unless we actually meet up and say, yeah. This is where we're meeting up. Do you know what I mean? Exactly. I don't know, I'm really not feeling carnival guys, like I'm really not feeling it. The only thing that would make me go would be like for my sister, like to have that experience. Yeah. She wants to go, don't deny her own Girl, bro, she's only 60, she she's got a whole, go. <laughs> she's got a whole life to live. No. Yeah. Good afternoon everyone. So it is... Monday bank holiday, 2.10, and I've decided that I'm going to go carnival. So I was so adamant that I wasn't gonna go because I'm just like, so over crowds and stuff. Um, but my sister really wants to go and Tamira was convincing me, so might as well go. This is my outfit of the day. Actually, I don't remember where I last left off. I think I was so invited to Mirror the last time I vlogged and then my camera decided to stop working like I have to format my memory card and everything but after I left to Mirror um I went to my uncle's um I went to go to my uncle's just to say hi and to um to say hi and to pick up my sister and then we ended up leaving at like one o'clock in the morning meaning we got home at like three in the morning because it was like a two hour journey at that time anyway from east to south croydon but anyway here we are slept and i feel okay i feel like i can maybe do this and this is my outfit of the day let me take away this this is my outfit of the day so i'm wearing this denim dress from zara i'm wearing these dunks bag shades and I think I'm good to go. And I'm just waiting on Janalia's stupid ass. We're already really late. Like, I don't even know if I'm going to see any of my friends. Because they're already there. And I haven't even left. So, anyway, this is the vibe. This is what we're going with. Per. You want to show us your outfit? Mm -hmm. Talk us through then. Shirt from H&M. H&M, uh, the shorts from Primark, bra from Primark. Um, you look so cute on camera. CDGs in a bag from JC. I can feel some drops of water on me. Hello, you all right? I can see drops of water. It's raining, it's no water. Is it? Yeah, yeah, it's sprinkles. Oh no. Water. Oh no.
Commission, I am the umpire, I spring the holy water upon a vampire. And this very mama I'm and this very mama I'm and this very mama I'm and and now we return with the crown. Yes. No, I'm not lucky. I'm blessed. Yes. Clap for the heavyweight champ. But I can't do it all alone. Young money, raise me. <laughs> Guys, I'm at my concert. It's a long journey, my feet are tired. You should ask. How are you feeling? Um, my feet are good. I have so much pain. Yeah, it's for you. I'm passing past through the um, Elizabeth line, and it's actually a really nice line. It's clean, fresh air. Like, I don't feel like I'm being choked with like underground air. Do you know what I mean? Feels decent. Anyways, yeah, cold and we need to get home. That's the mission. What would you rate carnival? Um, a nine. It would have been a ten if there wasn't so many pedophiles. Whoa. You can literally see I'm young, but they were still like, how old are you trying to move to me? There was this old old man grabbed while he was walking. Mm -mm. Not comfortable, but yeah. Oh no. Oh no. Hold up. Boxed him up. <laughs> Anyways, pray for us. We're getting home. Talk to you when we get there. Hi guys. 
so we're on the way to Victoria Station. Wait, wait, before, before, before you finish, whatever you're saying, pass the cover, pass the cover. Guys, look at this. <laughs> oh my days. <laughs> wait. Josie, you're doing this on my vlog. No, I would not do this on your vlog. Josie, chillax. Look, can you not see this? It's not even focusing. Why is it not focusing? Yeah, shame. Anyways, yeah, that's that's the train that we're catching. Anyways, yeah, um, Amber should apply to me. Delete my number, I'll keep yours. <laughs> wait. <laughs>